Hello everybody, this is Dee and welcome to my channel, Dee Plans and Budgets. Decided I'd just leave this on the screen by itself because it made a nice thumbnail. Thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate when you take time out to spend with me. Instead of waiting till the end, let me just like right now encourage y'all to subscribe, like, comment, notify, yada, yada, yada. For those of you who are older and remember Seinfeld, Anyhow, I also appreciate all those that prefer to be silent watchers. Any support is truly appreciated by moi. Now, what are we doing today? We're going to do my Monday minis. Yes, yes, yes. I absolutely love doing these. We're going to talk about my savings in this beautiful binder. And we're going to do the savings challenges, the book or the box, and then the book with all things Kimberly that I'm using to save for a cruise. And some of you are saving right along with me. Oh, that looks nice too. Look at that. Sorry, squirrel. Let's zoom you in and talk about what I spent. Now, I keep a different sheet for my regular tracking. And I think I shared on, I think my monthly. The reason I don't use that one to cover with you every month is all the different things that are on it. One is that I've reconciled, ones that I've reconciled with the credit card. Sometimes I am making a payment on a credit card because I put cash in there and it's all, it just gets mushy and a lot to present on YouTube. And then additionally, it doesn't always go week to week because it's month to month. So this is a good way for me to present the weekly spending that I did with you. On Monday, I bought seven shirts, Old Navy, $61.62. I thought that was a good deal and I desperately needed new summer shirts. Came home and got rid of a bunch of ones I had been wearing that I shouldn't have been. All right, on gas, $53.50. It is just climbing up there. On the 29th, that came and mowed my lawn. Thank you so much, nice lawn people. Looks wonderful. And I think I might have timed everything with a second spreading of weed to be gone. Whew, hoping, keep your fingers crossed. I may have lessened the amount of weeds in my yard. I know I didn't get them all. They're just too abundant in everybody's yards this year. I bought paper at Walmart for $9.97. I got the um, Hammer Mill premium copy paper, which I have linked in my description. And I love that for printing my savings challenges on. It has a little bit of a shiny glean to it and it's 28 pound. I also print regularly, or I used to use the Walmart 28 pound paper just to print my savings challenges on and photo paper. But I'm using the hammer mill for everything now and I love it. So I just needed some more paper for printing like journal pages or anything I need to print out actually, my, my budget planner pages, that kind of thing. But I don't like to use the cheapest of paper. So at Walmart, hammer mill had 24 pound copy paper. And since I'm so happy with the quality of their color paper, color, I, I'm sorry, at Walmart it's called laser paper and the high quality stuff I get is copy paper. Anyhow, they had it for the printers, just the regular printers. It was $9.97, just a few dollars more than the 20 pound cheap stuff. Then I decided to get it because I like a little bit beefier of a paper. I got some band-aids, $5.83. Household, I got laundry tabs, laundry, soap, TP, and I'm sorry, I didn't get laundry tabs. I got dishwasher tabs, laundry soap, TP, and some combo, their combo ibuprofen and Tylenol together. And I thought that was fantastic because sometimes I take those two together. Tylenol is better for um, headaches and Advil is better for body aches. And sometimes I feel like I have a headache because something hurts on my body. So I thought, oh, let's get that all in one tab. Fantastic. $25.45. And food, $41.40. So for this week, I spent $247.77. And then I have it broken down, not by individual category, but by overall category. $50 was my sinking funds, $61.62 in my low priority funds, and $136.15 in my variable spending. Fantastic. I'm going to zoom you out. I'm going to go get the stuff for the savings challenges. And hey, I'll meet you right back here, okay? All right. I am ready. Got my binder right here. Let's do some savings challenges. Now, this is the book from All Things Kimberly, and I have contributors. But first, let's do this box. 
let's see what I get today. And I'm adding these two together. So that's $6. Let's do one more. I'll just do the run, one I see in the front. That's $3. So that is nine. And I take this out of my walking around money. While I am here, I'm going to get a nice crispy tin and put it over here. And yucky five, yucky one, and three yucky ones. I don't care what I put in the box. And to be honest with you, all of the money that is in this box is most likely just going to go to a casino. And they don't care what the money looks like when you put it in the machine. So, got a few more of these down. In order to keep the amount smaller, I decided to add these two numbers together. Because I don't want to keep that much money sitting in a box. I have about eight or nine of these left. This will not be ready for my next cruise, but it'll be ready for my summer one. Alrighty, this one is done. Whoosh, let's do that one. And I'm done with this since I got the money out. Okay, who contributed this time? Actually, I have a whole bunch of people that contributed. I am keeping, let me show you, keeping a list right here so I can get to all of them. But these are the numbers that worked out this week. I have Ducky Budgets, and she contributed $3.21 with blue. I have Stitchy Saves, and she was $3.16 in red. Christina, $2.72 in yellow. Diane Edwards, $0.89 cents in mint. I think I have a mint color, and I'm just going to do $0.02 cents to round it all out in what other, whatever color is not near the two. Let's start in the back. Look at that. We have December all done. Okay, and you know what? I think this envelope is what made these like this. That's my theory. I'm sticking to it. Okay, 321 in blue. Let's get that colored in. And I picked this dark blue because there's kind of a um, teal blue or whatever next to this. So I decided to do this dark one so that it wasn't all the same color. I do like these Sharpies with the brush tips. And the next one is 316 in red. And that is right here. So look, now we got all these red and blues together. All right. Thank you so much, Ducky and Stitchy for those. Now the next one, Christina, 272 in yellow. And look, it's not even by another color of the same family. 272 in yellow. Thank you so much, Christina, for that. And Diana Edwards, 89. I hope this is minty enough for you. I loved that it was like mint, not green, but mint. Doesn't that seem minty to you? I mean, if that was on like the frosting on top of a cupcake and it was labeled as mint, I would be, yes, please. I will take that. It looks very minty to me. And then in my mind, it would taste like spearmint, right? Two cents. Let's do that in red. Oh, I got a red on here. Let's do it in dark blue. Okay. Yay. I specifically haven't been doing many over here because I want to save them for when the book starts to get very um, lean in choices. That will make it so that I am able to make numbers work. Okay, I took all of the money out of here, put it in the bank, and we need to start a new tracker. Wow. April 1st, Jill, and I'm not fooling. I did take the money out of here and needed to start a new tracker. Okay, so 4 one plus $10, 310. So I have this prop money, 100, 250, $310 in here. Yay, fantastic. Thank you so much for contributing, everyone. If you want to use this book specifically, you can get this from All Things Kimberly. If you would like to save but don't want to necessarily purchase the book, I do attach files to this video every single week so that you can play along if you want to. Time to randomize, y'all, and we're randomizing my cash. So, how much are we doing today? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 40, and 50. Yes, 50, not 25. Because this goes into my low priority binder, I decided to go ahead and up the amount that I'm doing. Okay, now let me get everything else ready and I'll be right back. 
I have these ones and some twos. Matter of fact, we're going to start with twos. So let me do that first. And I will buy back these uh, larger dollars with it when we are done. Let's move these up. I can do these by color if I want to as well, but I don't want to. So this one is from Reinventing Renee. And I left, or I'm sorry, this one is from Tracy at Golden Girl Budgets. I left this dollar out because I just need one more dollar to finish this. Fantastic. For those of you who ring the bell, you better get one ready for me because it's going to be a ring in. And this one is from Steph's on a Budget. Let's put the tab the correct way. And you cannot see this. Perfect. Come on, D. You can keep it tidy. Just move that out of the way for a second. And the next one, we all know her, Lee Inventing Renee, Budget Nerd Co. on Etsy. And Champagne's Corner. I have just a few left on this. It doesn't have anything marked for the teeth because I think they're supposed to be left white. Same with the whites and the eyes. This one could get done today. It's been really fun coloring that one. Okay. Boom. Boom. And this one, yay! And this is from Hey K Budgets. And this is a um, actually a no spend, but I am just going to use it to color in the little dots. And this one is from Tuatu, Chris Gilmore. Yes, you can see them all. All righty. I'm going to get this paper ready for when I start to color these in. We all know the process. Roll the dice putting the, the money down. And four. Yay, Champagne's Corner. Got that. I forget who told me that uh, was from Champagne, but thank you because I did not know who it was from. And one again, I have more challenges, don't worry, because as we know, that one's done with Tracy. And two again. Oh, come on. I want to color avocados. See, look. Yay, I get to color avocados. Fantastic. Six. Six. Hey, Chris wants to get hers done. She's serious. And two. And one. And five. Yay for more avocado pits. And four. And four again. Ooh, I might be able to get champagnes done. And one again. Tracy, you don't need all that. You only needed one more dollar. She's going to take it all, even though it's not going to go into her challenge. Oh, well, and three is getting two more. Who gets the last two? Six is two. Do I have enough here to finish champagnes? I think so. All right, because I was going to cheat if not and put it in there. Okay, let's clear that off. Let's put it back. I'll be right back. And we'll put all these aside. I have some Sharpies out here. I know I need the brown one for the avocado pot pits. I've been way looking forward to that. Okay, this one from Chris Gilmore, Tuatu. I got the blue out that I think I've been using. How much is she getting today? One, two, three, four, six, eight, ten, and twelve. Okay, one, two, three, four, six, eight, ten. Taking the ten. Okay, twelve dollars going in today. Let's finish. So five. Seven. Ooh, got two rows done. Eight, nine. Ten. Eleven, twelve. Okay, and a lot of this I colored on top of the envelope, but why didn't y'all stop me and tell me to get my mat? Whew. Okay, twelve dollars. How much does this one have? This is going to save sixty dollars altogether. Well, that's good. And what does this have all together? Actually, let's go five, 10, and take that last 10. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. And grab this five. This one now has 10, 20, 30, five, and 37. Well, that's good. Yay. I think I got to go out of these tabbed envelopes as much as I like them. They're hard to get the money in and out of. Oh, well. Okay, next. Oh, from my friend, Renee. Reinventing Renee. Budget Nerd Co. on Etsy. 
Let's get some of this out. Oh, I need to know how much I need. What do we have? Two, three, two, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's start with five. And we still have eight, so that's going to be four complete ones of these. Oh, I'm going to be so close. I'm going to um, zoom through this and be right back. Alrighty, this is done. You know, while I'm organizing this, I want to mention this is from Champagne's Corner originally, right? She's the one, I think, who really started this uh, varying degrees of uh, the randomized with the money. Just a second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Anyhow, and I was watching her video the other day, and she does these pretty much... $22, two more next week. Anyhow, she does these pretty much as a no edit. <laughs> Champagne, wow, right? <laughs> I don't know how you do it. Okay, Steph's on a budget. What do we got? One, two, three, four, six, eight dollars. I do like the fives or the twos in here, so let's do that. And I did this one in a cute little light pink. I got the color right here, and it's going to be $8, but these are $3 each, so we're going to do six, and then we're going to double check and see if I have any extra cash in here. I think I'm going to do the way that, um, who is it that does this? Is it, it might be Lisa Grateful Me. She just makes them all whatever each time she does them, right? So three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21. I have 5, 10, 15, 21, 22, 23. Two of these will go to this side. The rest will go this way. And that will make sure I remember that I have extra ones to do next week. All righty, next. Tracy, oh, you know what? Let's do that one last. Let's do the ones I'm going to finish last. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Hey, K budgets. I have been just waiting to do this. I'm just doing this as a dollar each, and she got four today. All right. Yay, look. I'm coloring in the avocado pits. Oh, my gosh. I've just been wanting to do this every time, ever since I saw these. But I don't do no spins. And then I thought, you know what? I can just do those as a dollar a piece. And then I colored it. Not so nice. Oh, well. $4. This one is started. Thank you, Kay, for that freebie. Those are on her website. Hey, Kay Budgets, go over there. Grab those little avocados. So cute. While you're there, watch her channel. She's amazing. This one from Champagne. Are we going to finish it today? Two, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Two, four, six, eight. We are so going to finish this today. Okay, so I need a red for this horn. That's two. And what is that supposed to be? Well, we're going to make it a little horn. Four. And inside his nostril. Perfect. Six. Oh, no. Eight. I'm short. One to finish. Two, four, six, eight. Okay. This will come back next week. Two, four, and five. And this is going in here. Five, six, seven, and eight. I can't believe that. Do I have two more ones in here? I do not. This one's even at a dollar a piece is giving me a good little savings amount. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, one, two, and three. And you know what? I'm making a command decision because that's freaking me out because he has only one eye. I know I have too much in Tracy's. I am taking that money. I'm selling a five and I'm putting it in here. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. This is a finished challenge. Woot, woot. Put that in my box of savings. Ring a bell if you ring them, y'all. Okay, and lastly, Tracy from Golden Girl Budgets. I just need two of these. Two, four, five, because I want the five or the twos. And then one, two, three, four. So nine dollars, because remember I had a one left last time. Two of these are going to go into this challenge. Let's color this in. <laughs> what is that? Let's make the little umbrella red. 
And I think, I think it's supposed to be a coconut. Let's make it brown, right? That's a coconut drink. A half-shelled coconut? That's what I think. All right. If you ring the bell, give me a ring. And let's see if I have $22 in here. 5, 10, 15, 20, and 22. I do. Yay. Another one is done. I'm just going to hold this so I can pop it into the next video. This is the cigar box we're going to use for this month for our completed challenges. Boop. They are in there. Yay. Got a bunch of these one time at a flea market and I absolutely love them. Okay. Back to the video. I need to go grab another challenge. Let's get that notebook. I've got challenges already in here and ready to go. This one was sent to me from um, uh, Budget Boo, but it says CO on here. But it was custom made for D plans and budgets. Look, isn't it cute? And it was a Grinch one. And I am going to start that. And then in Tracy's, Let's go ahead and do this one from the one that was Tracy's. This is from uh, Mr. Budgets, of course. And I'm choosing that one specifically because I'm just going to do a dollar a spot. I don't have to worry about these odd numbers. So $7 is going in here. Let's color that in, and I'm going to be right back. Okay, I got a good start on this one. So next week we will be doing, check her out. It's it's Budget Boo and it's, she has CO here first. So that may be her Etsy shop name, but it is Budget Boo. You can find her on um, YouTube, love her channel. And I love that she made this for me and she made it with the matte laminate. It is gorgeous and it's Grinch and I love Grinch. And so these will be our ones for next time. We're getting really close. We'll be finishing some up. All right. And I am positive I have all the money here. I'm not going to put you through counting it, but don't worry. I will count it before I put it back into the binder. Hope you all have a wonderful week ahead. And until the next one, bye.